Hey guys, welcome into this new video. So let's take a look of how we can add a bank account here into PayPal.com. So whether you have a personal account or an account for your business, it's actually the same method. But let's take a look into the business account. So first of all, what I want to do is to go a little bit up, go into my account settings, and I want to go into my money, banks and card section. So once you have me here, as you can see, I have none, nothing about my bank account. I don't have any cards right now. This is the current management. So what I want to do is to select here the link in new bank account. So I'm going to select this plus button. So if you want, you can add a account number in here, uh, our 18 digit uh, number at the bottom of this check or the bank statement. And here we can put a account name, whether that would be your business or your personal name if you want to. And once you're linked and confirm this bank, you'll be able to automatically transfer funds to it and you can go into link your bank. So now if you are into the US, you can click in here, it says link a US bank instead. So once you are in here, it's going to be asking you again for a checking or a saving account, a routing number and an account number. All this information is going to be provided by your bank. If you don't know about your routing number or the account number, you can go and contact your bank so you can receive the information it's going to be asking for linking an account uh, from the US. So let's go back into a personal account and see if it's the same method. So as you can see, I'm into my private account from PayPal.com. So what I want to focus on is on my wallet section, which is actually arriving here. And I have a few uh, credit cards added in here. So if you don't see any card or you want to add another card, you select the option that says linked a bank account or you can link a card. But I totally recommend you guys to link first a bank account so they will be really really easy to make in transfer deposit and withdraw your money so once again let's put out your account number in here your name your legal name if you want to you can use this bank for automatic transfers that depends to you guys so you can enable that or not and just hit into link your bank so I'm gonna go into close and you should see that your um, bank account is now in here if you can if you want to you can give a nickname so as you can see, it's really easy guys. So you can add a bank and for linking a card is actually the same process. You can add a debit or credit card. You can select which type of card, the expiration date, the security code and your billing address. So after you linked a card, this one is going to be charging you less than a dollar again. So you can be providing the amount of money that was uh, charged to your account. As I just said before, that could be like uh, 25 cents or 14 cents I'm not pretty sure but again this is just for verification and you're gonna be receiving your money after the verification has been successfully done so there you have it guys let me know if you have any question don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about PayPal thank you for watching the video and I'll see you next time